And I, I was thinking of you, Senator, when I heard Bob Costas, I don't know if you started watching the Olympics. If you're on another network, I, I suggest you don't waste the time. But uh, he really was praising Vladimir Putin as a little but a great statesman, a peacemaker. What did you think of that? I thought it was that Bob Costas ought to stick to sports because he obviously didn't know what the hell he was talking about. Look, this is the same This guy is being recorded, they, Senator. This is just yeah. like that. State Department. He, he didn't know what he was talking about. I mean, this guy is an autocrat. He ethnically cleansed, uh, not ethnically, but uh, cleansed uh, uh, Chechnya, uh, radicalized that place. He, uh, he is, uh, while we're talking about removal of chemical weapons, Mr. Costas forgot to mention that plane loads of Russian uh, military equipment are landing in Damascus. Uh, they're killing uh, Syrian men, women, and children. Uh, the, the guy is causing all kinds of problems to every country on the periphery of Russia. Uh, he, he, well, he is what he is. He's an old Colonel KGB apparatchik, nothing more, nothing less. And Mr. Costas, <laughs> giving him this kind of credit, is uh, borders on the ludicrous. So you're not making a general damning indictment of people who read Prompter for a living weighing in on the <laughs> issues of our day, right? Not at all, and I've admired uh, Bob Costas' knowledge of sports and his in-depth analyses from time to time. I watch his program quite often, but on this one, Bob, uh, stick to the hockey games, will you? <laughs> okay, Senator John McCain, thank you very, very much. In the meantime, to all the